Adventures in Second Life, Episode 13. In our last episode, we were moving through the preferences area in Second Life, which is a very, you know, one of the most complicated areas in Second Life. <laughs> Uh, not that you, anyone has to actually play with any of that stuff, but of course you would if you're really into it. So let's open that up again, preferences. And we left off at audio and video in which I said, you know, there are a lot of settings here which you can hit pause and take a look. I mean, you know, check this out, you know, under audio preferences, Doppler effect. Can you imagine? You can play with that in here. The volume I do um, work with, and we'll get to that later as I mentioned in the previous episode um, there's an area down here that has the media um, controls and so we'll we'll touch on that once we get down there if we get there so to continue text chat okay well text chat is where we can open up down here you can see a text chat window this is what you might see um, I might say you know whatever Hello world, and um, you can see there infrared wind. Hello world. Of course, I'm talking to nobody because there's nobody near me. But if somebody w was near me, they would see that. And also, there are uh, again contacts. Uh, there are group chats. So this is a, a very, uh, you know, full-fledged instant messaging and chat system, which we'll get into. But this, what we're, where we're focused now, is within the preferences. And so what we see here is you can set the, the font size. Um, you can set the colors for different, you know, types of chat items. Like it's from you or it's from objects, blah, blah, blah. Um, and a lot of other settings which you can check out by hitting pause. Um, well, one I'll mention is play, typing, animation when, when chatting. If this is checked, that means when you uh, type something, your uh, avatar will animate. Let's see if I can demonstrate that. I'll turn it on. I'll hit apply. And then I will type something in the chat bar. See? Isn't that cute? <laughs> yeah, I mean, sometimes I like that. Okay, so to continue on, um, so this is our text chat um, settings. Voice chat, you can enable voice chat, which means you can use a microphone. Um, Second Life is very cool because it also has mouth animations when you're talking, and you can control, like, uh, if you want to use a a button so that only when you hold the button you talk. I like to use insert for that. Or you can just leave it on all the time. So again, you can hit pause and you can see um, what some of these functions are. And I just noticed something that mouse overs do provide some nice tool tips um, are worth looking around at. Well, at least this one. Okay, device settings, right. Uh, communication. My online status, I am options, you know, a lot of, th again, you know, hit, click pause, you can see what a lot of this stuff is. Um, yeah, m a lot of this don't need to really change that much. Pop-ups, how to handle those. This is, this is a little bit complicated bit, but it does, um, again, you can hit pause, kind of look at this. Skins, we, of course, you would know what that is uh, here. Uh, there are a few, not many, um, and the one I'm using is really from the very early days. Grids, what's Grids all about? It's, oh, this is where you actually can log in to other um, grids. Second Life itself, the public one is one particular grid, but people do run their own servers and stuff, so this is another area for that. Advanced Chat, wow, okay, lots of stuff. Hit pause, take a look at some of these things. Chat UI, oh my god. A uh, lot of stuff here. Auto responses that you can set up. Again, you could hit pause to see, read this. Um, how to handle spam. 
uh, text options most of the stuff I don't use but my goodness the functionality that's in Second Life is really staggering system wow we're gonna leave that uh, <laughs> for the next episode so we'll, this is where we'll pick up on uh, episode 14 so that's uh, episode 13 as we move through the UI and you know where we're where we're heading is we want to get all this out of the way and then we can start exploring Second Life itself but it's a long um, the syllabus is large and we're gonna um, continue with uh, with that before we venture off <laughs>